So, all you really need to know about Joel Osteen is that he is Dr. Norman Vincent Peale's The Power of Positive Thinking with a little bit of modern uh, fake news, kind of politically correct mumbo-jumbo mixed in. For instance... Uh, he does a bit on flushing out lack thoughts, that phrase, flushing out the lack thoughts. That's all, that's Norm, uh, Dr. Norman Vincent Peale. Uh, just recently was listening to a piece by, uh, by Joel about, you know, you can't, you can't change other people. You can only change how you react to them. Which is really another way of saying what Dr. Norman Vincent Peale said about uh, it's, it's an attitude uh, you, you know, attitude is more important than facts. Um, how, so, and, um, and there's, there's one more thing that's escaping me right now, but the point is that uh, Joel Osteen is essentially Dr. Norman Vincent Peale's The Power of Positive Thinking um, with a whole bunch of uh, political correctness uh, dumped on top of it uh, in order to make it more uh, palatable to a... Uh, a, a mass audience of, of, of people today uh, with whom uh, theories about um, you know, certain subsets of the population uh, genetically being more intelligent or driven, etc., have kind of fallen out of favor. Uh, Joel Osteen is Dr. Norman Vincent Peale's The Power of Positive Thinking. Of course, he never gives Dr. Norman Vincent Peale credit because, well, because then you couldn't sell books that say Joel Osteen. You'd have to say uh, sell, you know, Dr. Norman Vincent Peale's book. So I, I do find that a tad just disingenuous. Because if you're going to call yourself a pastor, well, you should at least be uh, have at least the integrity of uh, the elitist academics, which is not a lot, and give the darn. Dr. Norman Vincent Peale credit for the ideas that you're ripping off. At least, you know, give him give him a quote or something. This is America's Man's Man. America's Man's Man.com.